What's up everybody, beloved pup here with another video of Life Simulator. We left off with me selling my old home and buying a new one and now we're caught up. Alright, so let's go. Let's start off now with an event. You are invited to a cocktail party. What do you wear? Clothes. <laughs> Obviously clothes. Um, Kevin, a regular floral shirt in brown. Okay. A supersized, a super oversized red satin shirt. Hmm. Huh. Okay. I can see that. Okay. A long sleeve kiwi print shirt. This is a cocktail party. What? A satin shirt? I don't know. It sounds fancy if I hear a cocktail party. Jeez. Everyone is amazed by your sense of fashion. Oh, it's a good choice. Okay. Ooh, Kevin, you're good sometimes. Rarely. Rarely. Yeah, rarely. But it's super oversized. You're probably like thin as hell. But it's okay. It's okay. Everyone is amazed by... Yeah. Okay, event. While reading your favorite book, you hear a subtle sound coming from across the window. A subtle? It's okay. Get a closer look. Read somewhere else. You attempt to ignore the sound. Kevin, you'd go closer. Uh, it's just the lost dog pacing over the dried leaves. You give it some food. Is it mine? I've always wanted a dog. No. Puh. Of course it wouldn't give me anything. <laughs> it's because I already have two pets. Two cats? Is it? Is it that? Is that the reason? It's okay, you can tell me. I always wanted a dog. <laughs> I just decided to grab cats instead. <laughs> Please, just tell me already. <laughs> Nothing? Okay. That's okay, too. You have to tell me anything. That's so rude. Kevin. Oof, I almost clicked on the money one. I got problems with... My, I'm freaking... Tap crazy. <laughs> tap on everything. For some reason. My husband doesn't like spending time with me anymore. Should I be concerned? Is there another... A uh, man? Apparently it's a man. Socializing. Your friend confesses that he is an atheist? Okay. Accept him for who he is. Argue with him that your religion is the right one. Try to understand his reasoning. Accept him. Ugh. Sorry, I'm a, I'm a little chillin' now. You respect every person's beliefs and refrain from interfering. That sounds about right, yeah. <laughs> Health. All of a sudden, you feel a great deal of nausea flooding your senses. Oh, <gasps> you're pregnant, Kevin! Oh my god, why didn't you tell me? Sleep it off. Pursue a doctor. Spin around for 30 minutes. That's a terrible idea. Let's go to the doctor. Your doctor and administer skin. <sighs> Sorry. The doctor administers several doses of penicillin. You feel better. What was wrong? <sighs> She's just prescribing things. Don't even tell me what's wrong with me. Kevin. With Kevin. So into this character. You don't even tell me what's wrong with me. The love of my life doesn't like spending time with me. He's so damn needy. My gosh. Talk with my kids. 
No, honey, we're not getting a divorce. We're getting in an argument. There's a difference. I remember my beta doesn't like spending time play with me either. Ugh. And then Asia, so needy. So needy. The cats, my gosh. Reminds me of my sister's cat, Tyler. You know, I think my eyes are playing tricks on me. I should, like, uh, just, you know what? That bar on Asia was totally going to finish and then decided to decrease, which was really weird. And she decreased again. That makes no sense. I just, I just did everything. I just got her whole bar. You know what, Asia? <sighs> you're so weird. I know you're a baby. I'm sorry, baby. Asia, I swear. Stay up. Good. <sighs> my goodness, man. Why are my animals so needy? They're just as bad as my husband. Next. Golem graduated from education. Go. Wow. He's already 18? Where have I been in my child's life? I didn't even recall he was 18 already. Has he decided what he's gonna do with his life? I mean, I can't even think of that. It's not even an option to think of it. Next. <clears throat> Beta started in education. Beta's 13 in middle school? I mean, Lunar hasn't even started school yet. <laughs> Three months later, Lunar starts school. Okay. Um, how old is he? He's 53. And my husband is 55. Hey, babe, can we have another baby? No, please. Yeah, all I have to say is please, and I get a baby. Is it a girl? Yes! Woo! Party over here. I finally get a little girl. I want a little girl forever. Yes. No, Eleanor. Jacqueline, Christine, Marceline, Marceline, Kayla, Ugh. Maria, Zaya. Okay. Uh, no. <laughs> Meloni. Melon. No, it's Meloni. No. Um. I had her name, but I forgot it. Uh. <sighs> Let's leave her Neva. N E I V A. Neva. Yeah. Neva. Oh, husband. I know I was rude as ever, but no, I love you. And we got a little girl. I'm content. We don't need any more children. <laughs> <coughs> Lunar, Beta, Golem, Ronnie, my mom, who was a, the oldest trooper I know, it's my mom, alright, and my family here, oh yeah, how old is she, I didn't even pay attention, 
She's seven months. Wow. Okay. I had a nine-month-old, a three-year-old, a four-year-old, and now a nine-month-old. That's still good. I like that. So that's three, four, five. Five bedroom. Yeah, not including my mom. <laughs> good. Next partner. I mean, relationship. Your partner is forced to travel for one month to resolve work issues. Well, he is a musician, so I guess it's fine. Convince him or her to stay. Share your views on these work issues. <laughs> Do they have to rhyme it? Okay. <clears throat> Gift him or her a bracelet to make him or her remembers you. To make him remembers you in their journey. Okay. Let's do the last one. Wait, Kevin, what would you choose? Yeah, the last one, right? <laughs> he or she adores your gesture and plants kisses all over your face oh stop you're embarrassing me <laughs> i love you too you're gonna be gone for a long time a whole month i'm devastated i think my boyfriend will be over for a week Jeez. <sighs> event it's late at night and the neighbors are being too loud and noisy. Okay. Call them up. No. Complain to the police. No. Try to avoid the noise by using your plug. <laughs> what kind of noise? Hopefully it's not the other noise I'm thinking of. The no-no noise. But the... Music. Yelling, screaming, jumping... TV, talking, fighting, um, <clears throat> avoid it, <clears throat> the earplugs prove useless to the chaos happening upstairs, they keep you up most of the night, so should I have called the police, you just don't tell me what kind of noise, you just say noise, what am I supposed to think of noise, jeez, so rude, alright, beta, Lunar. Uh -huh. Neva. You feed my year old. Asia. Yes. That's it? Just abandon her like that? Oh, that's so sad. If only you could sell your pets. Can you? No. You could sell them. It'd be awesome. You abandoned my... I abandoned my cat. It just doesn't say which one. <laughs> Health. Oh, no. You discover that your partner has... Is diagnosed with syphilis. Syphilis. Help him or her treatment. Demand answers now. Ignore everything and do it. You want... You know what you want now. What does that mean? I'm so confused. Kevin? What will you do? Help him with treatment? Demand answers? I'm so confused. What is syphilis? I don't know. Give him treatment? He or she is really careful for understanding and help. Honestly, now that I've helped you, I want answers. How in the world did you get syphilis? Stupid. Gosh. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> uh, I can't feel offended because I don't know what it is. I am so old. I'm 26 years old, and I don't know what syphilis is. 
That's okay. Right? It's fine. It doesn't matter. Alright. <gasps> Baby! I'm sorry! Come on. We like Bebe better. Next. Lifestyle. You attend a, an amateur night at the community club. Comedy club. Hoping to make your big break. What are you talking about? You're a bit of a shy person, but you love jokes. You're always watching other stand-up comedians. Uh, you know what to do. Just go with the flow and depend on the turnout of the show. Okay. Hmm. You know what to do. At first, all goes well until you are pressured to produce new jokes on the spot. How intimidating. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we'll go with that. Health. Your friend points out that you have a pallid complexion. What is a pallid complexion? Attempt to examine yourself. Seek a doctor. Persuade him or her that you saw a ghost. This pale? I don't know. You're a dive. You're diagnosed with anemia. Anemia. Oh, it's, that's a iron deficiency. Well, you don't have enough iron. I know what that is, but I don't know what syphilis is. I got a raise. Yeah, a lot of money. <laughs> Uh, husband, you got issues, man. We've been gone for a month. Well, technically three, because you know it's fine. I don't have to explain it to you. You're not even here. <sighs> All right, everyone's good. Excuse me. Well, I'm going to leave the video here. I am tired. It's late. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.